Hey, what's going on out there? I'm Jeffrey with Grill and Smoke Barbecue. I've been craving something all week. So today I decided I'm gonna make it. And it's a great side to go with any protein that you would like to make. And it's gonna be bacon wrapped jalapeno poppers. Let's do it. Okay, so what I have here, 10 jalapenos, and I have a bowl. This is gonna be where I'm gonna put the seeds and stuff when I core it out so that they're not just everywhere. So for those who don't like spicy jalapenos, you core it out, take the seeds out, and it's really not that spicy anymore once you do that. Myself, if y'all watch my channel, you know I like spicy food. So I will probably leave some of the seeds in there, but for the few that I'm gonna show you how to do, I'll probably just take everything out so that y'all can see how it's done. So the way out, there's several ways to do it. A lot of people or whatever will cut the stem off and then cut it in half and make two out of one. I mean, if you're having people over and you need to make it stretch, that's a good way to do it. But I'm gonna be the only one eating this. So I'm gonna keep it whole and I'm gonna show you how I do it. So what I like to do is come down the middle and just before I get to the end stop, come down over the top of it and just take it off like that. And what I got here is a, I believe it's called a tomato core or whatever. But now for me, it's a jalapeno core. So what I do is I take it, go inside, and then just scrape down. There's an easy way to get all this stuff out of here. So as you can see, pretty clean. And clean off the other side.
top of that, I'm going to add some Cosmos Q hot cow cover. Just to add some more seasoning to it. And you can use a spoon or whatever you want to mix it up. I'm just gonna use my hand. Okay, so there you have it. Put this to the side. I'm gonna go ahead and get my jalapenos back out. All right, so here we are with the jalapenos. Remember I said I was gonna keep them together so that I made sure they fit back together right when I was ready. So what I'm gonna do, grab some of the filling Just go ahead and put it in there. Then just take the lid, put it back on. You have your little, I guess you could call this kind of a boat design, I would guess. But on top of that, you gotta put the bacon. Oh. Now we have our bacon. We just wrap it around. Make sure it's good and covered. Put it back down and you're ready. Go ahead and do another one for you. Get it good and filled in there. Take the top. Put it back on and get a piece of bacon. Get your bacon. Now I'm gonna let that sit, sweat in a little, while I go get the smoker up to temp. All right, so here we go. We're gonna be doing these at 300 degrees. Estimate probably take about 60 to 90 minutes. And see them. I should probably check back in on them in about 30 minutes just to see how they're doing. Yeah. 
30 minutes into it. Let's take a look. And it's coming along nicely. And in case I forgot to mention, I'm using the Pit Boss Competition Blend Pellets. And we'll check back in another 30 minutes. Okay, we're an hour in. Yep. And of course, the best part, let's taste it. So, here we go. I am. That is good. I'm not gonna lie, probably the best jalapeno popper I've ever had. That uh, I can taste that Cosmos Q in the uh, mix, and I can also taste that Uncle Steve shake on the outside of the bacon. And as we all know, bacon makes everything better. So I got to finish this. Mm. That is good. Man, I highly encourage you to try it. If you like jalapeno poppers, try it. Never had it before, thinking about doing it, try it. Never had it before, don't know if you want to do it, still try it. So, all in all, great, great successful cook. Now, I want to thank everyone for watching with me. All of those who have been rocking with me from the beginning, those who this might be your first time, I appreciate you. Uh, feel free to send me an email. Let me know if you want to see me make something. Uh, if you got some stickers, you want to do a sticker swap, I should have my stickers in soon. Um, don't forget to subscribe. Click the like button. Ring the bell so you can be notified whenever I post new content. And... Till next time, I'm out.